In the 21st century, we can't imagine our life without a car. The car gives us a sense of confidence and comfort. We are not ready to leave our car even in spite of time wasted in the traffic jams. Car is moving thanks to the engine. Here it is. In spite of the modern engine contains thousands of details, the main principle is very simple. Let's see how it works. To make you understand better the principle of the engine, we'll try to explain it in easy way. In every engine there is a cylinder and a piston. They are made of metal to stand high loadings and temperatures. Here, in the cylinder, the thermal energy transforms in motion. We assembled the simple engine model that will help you to understand better the principle of its work. It contains a cylinder, a piston, and a manometer that will show us the pressure in the cylinder. To show the process of heat energy transformation in the motion energy, we will use this heater, and little by little we are warming the cylinder. The manometer will show the pressure changing. The temperature in the cylinder is growing. As you see, as a result, the pressure is also growing. The compression increasing makes the piston moving. When the piston moves inversely, the compression in the piston increases. The pressure that is generated in the moment of high squeeze is called compression. The more engine is worn out, the less compression is. Thus, the compression of petrol engines is 12 atmospheres, and for diesel engines the compression is up to 20 atmospheres, that is severely more. With the help of this simple model, we will show you how forward movement of the piston transforms in the car motion. As you see, the pressure increases and the piston becomes to move down and gets in motion the simple chair that is called crank mechanism. As you see, the piston moves, the car is moving forward, the wheels are moving. This simple way the engine is done, in spite of the real engine has more details. To make the piston moving easily inside of cylinder and the engine working like the Swiss watch, it needs lubricating. The grease should be permanent and should reach the highest parts of the engine. This is achieved by splash of oil by a huge mixer that is called crankshaft. The most difficult part of lubricating is the highest part of cylinder because of hard axis and high temperature. To reach the high part of the engine, the oil should have normal viscosity. If the oil is very thick, it would be spread more difficult and the high parts of the engine will suffer because of low lubrication. In its turn, it leads to high wear and aging overheating. Every engine is varying out during the working process. The wear is determined by blue exhausts. Blue exhausts appearing in tailpipe testify that motor oil gets in the combustion chamber through the clearance between cylinder and piston which I appeared with the wearing. If the oil burns, your engine is worn out and needs repairing. Often we try to solve the oil burning problems with help of autochemical products. One of the most popular methods is using of oil viscosity. It is a transparent and viscous liquid of yellow color. Adding to the oil, it increases its viscosity. Let's see what does happen. 
This model shows the work of oil viscosity. Here, there is a motor oil without any additives. And as we see, during the mixing, it reached the highest parts of the engine. Here, where we added the oil viscosity, the oil spray is difficult. There is a lack of oil in the high parts of the engine. The reason of oil burning decreasing is that the oil doesn't get to combustion chamber as a result of a lack of oil. On the one hand, we see decreasing of blue exhaust, but on the another hand, we are in front of lubricating deficit in the high part of the engine that leads to engine overheating and high wearing. The engine will not work long time because of lack of lubricating. You lead your engine to the prompt dead. To show the principle of the next product, that is called resource, we'll need two metal surfaces. We will apply the metal plating paste on the surface of wealth and we'll grind it. Then we'll see what is formed on the surface. We apply a metal plating paste that is used for making resource. After paste applying, we grind the wealth. To show the principle of resource application, we'll put in contact two metal surfaces, like it is in the real engine between piston and cylinder. It is very important to keep the real loading and temperature. As we see, after the treatment with resource, a new metal layer appeared. It is a kind of new metal skin of your engine that treats all damages of your engine. On the example of this process, we would like to show you the principle of remetalizer resource. It contains of small particles that remain in the friction zones of the detail and create a new metal skin treating the damages of your engine. This process increases the efficiency factor of your engine, reduce the oil burning and don't change the oil viscosity. In that way, you get the perfect result without any side effect.